So, Aubrey, you're not in the sheriff's department anymore. You're, you're somewhere very strange. Uh, you, you look around, and you've got the, the, um, the, the form of Deputy Dewey in front of you. Uh, but both of you are just, like, inside of this massive hollow sphere. Uh, and all around you, everywhere, are, are visions that are so far away you can barely make out, like, what they are. It's like you are surrounded by, like, a skybox in a video game. Like, just this huge static image that surrounds you on all sides. Uh, and you see, like, root systems growing downward through lush green fields. Uh, and rivers of magma and uh, waves on the ocean. And it looks like you're looking up at all this stuff from like below a big glass table. Uh, and you see these like little pinpricks of light everywhere, uh, just like concentrated heavily around certain parts of this like sphere you're inside and sparse in others. And some of them are moving and some are flickering and reappearing somewhere else. Um, you are in the middle of just like this massive eco ball. Uh, and Dewey's form is floating in front of you, and he is motionless, but his wounds are gone. And then floating on the other side of Dewey, a figure appears, and uh, it has a hand extended and pressed gently on Dewey's chest. And this figure is uh, a woman, and, and you get this like feeling when you look at her. Uh, and it's the kind of feeling you get like when you swear you've met someone before, but like a thousand times stronger than that. Uh, like this presence feels like it could be it could be like family, like it could be your sister if you if you had one. Um, and you feel this like warmth and familiarity with this 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 figure, this person who uh, so closely like resembles you in a way. And they actually look a little bit surprised to see you. Uh, and she she does a little wave. What do you do? Magic? Are you magic? Uh, she like cocks her head to the side. Uh, and smiles and does not take her hand off of uh, Dewey. And she kind of like gestures down towards him. Are you, you're helping me do magic, right? To help Dewey? She looks up at you and uh, smiles and nods. Awesome. Hey, thanks. I sure do appreciate it. Uh, she takes her other hand now and places it. Uh, uh, she actually, no, what she does is she reaches out with her other hand and she uh, grabs you by the wrist. Um, uh, it feels like you've just like grabbed a uh, like a live wire, uh, but not painful. You just feel this like rush of uh, like euphoria and energy as she touches you uh, and she places your hand on Dewey and then she she nods. Okay, let's let's do this. Should we chant like heal, 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 or is what? Uh, she is so focused on Dewey right now that she does not. Uh, she she actually closes her eyes, uh, and uh, now you can feel that energy again, almost like it is being sort of pushed through Dewey, like you formed like a conduit uh, with this 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 uh, placing laying on hands that the two of you are doing, um, and Dewey starts to glow, uh, just this beautiful light. And he's then pregnant. He is pregnant. He's a wonderful pregnant uh, deputy. Uh, and then this figure looks up at you and she opens her eyes and she just has these bright orange glowing eyes. <gasps> and then you wake up 